it's time for Two Minutes Two, where I have two minutes to show you simple ways that can make your life a little bit easier. So today I'm going to create a chic serving tray. Let's get started. Now, I don't know about you, but every time I open a magazine lately or I'm looking online, I'm seeing these fabulous Lucite trays. They're serving trays, they're display trays, they're amazing, and they cost an arm and a leg. So I put on my thinking cap for you guys, and I figured out how we can get the look for a lot less. First, we start with an acrylic box frame. You can get them at every craft store, you can get them at frame shops, they're really inexpensive, really easy to come by. I also have decorative paper, a couple of different options. I have a ruler, a triangle, scissors, and a craft blade. If you're the person that really wants these tools because you want it to be perfect, you go for it, you're a rock star. I'm the girl that just wants to get it done. So, you lay out your paper, the paper of your choice, you lay it fancy side down, and then you take the box insert from the acrylic frame. You lay it on your paper, and there's your template. It's that easy. You trace around the edges, you cut it out, and you have a perfectly fitted piece of paper that's gonna go perfectly inside your little tray. So once I've done that, I can get rid of the insert. We won't need it again. I bring over my, my tray. Look at that. I lay the paper in. You'll notice I'm not using glue. I'm not using any tape. I'm laying it down. How simple is that? Now here's the thing. I have chosen today to use a little wood print paper, which is a great look for something a little more casual. So if you have an event where maybe it's a barbecue, maybe you've got like a picnic style thing happening outside, this is a great look. But what I love about not taping or gluing any of the paper down is that I can switch this out according to mood or season. This could be a holiday tray, depending on the paper I put in. This could be a spring tea party tray. This could have many different lives. Um, the other thing to consider is that this is a great Great serving tray, it's how I'm going to use it today, but it also is a fantastic tray to set onto a vanity. This could totally house my cosmetics, my perfume bottles, I have quite a collection. So if you do too, this is a great way to contain them and to make them look just a little bit fancy. And another thing, if you're a pet owner, which I also am, and your pet is a mess, which mine totally is, what a great dog food tray. Put this on the floor, put your water dish, your kibble dish, the kibble can't go past the edges. What I would do in that case though is I would line it with vinyl, something that's washable because it's gonna get a little wet and messy. So back to the tray, I have it all done. You saw how fast that happened. Got my pitcher. I have some refreshing drinks for my guests. Look at that, so simple. It looks great. People are gonna wonder how you did it, how much you paid, and you and I will know the secret. Thanks for watching Two Minutes Two. Now be sure to share this on social or leave a comment below with the hashtag OwnShow.